Hey everyone, in this video I'm just going to run through uh, a Tajin unit set up with a Mako TE. Um, it's a Mako TE for Tajin. If you have a look here, you'll see that there will be a T marked on the little microcontroller. If it has a T there, it is for the Tajin MFU. If it has a H, it is for the Henglong MFU. Okay, just notice too with your connections, the input is on this side of the unit, so that goes into the Tajin MFU, the output here goes to your battle unit and I'm using one of my hammerhead units today. Uh, over this side we have your normal LMOD setup um, with your blaster and your you know the, the battle system that they have there. At the moment I've got the uh, sound disconnected so we'll just connect up the sound and, and let's get going. Sound in there, sound in here. Okay, so now I've got to speak a little bit louder. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to have the Tajin unit fire at the LMOD unit and we'll see what happens. So as you can see, and I fired, the, um, the LMOD unit was hit. Lights flashed it and made that noise. Fire again. Okay, so you can see we've got signal going from your Mako TE activating your LMOD. Now we'll fire the LMOD at the Tajin unit. As you can see there, works both ways. We'll fire again. We'll wait for the reload period actually. Okay, now fire again. And as you can see, the lights will flash on my hammerhead unit to tell you that the signal from the LMOD is being received by the the Tajin unit. So we'll keep firing at each other. I'll wait for the reload. There's a long reload on the LMOD. I think I just might kill off the LMOD while we're waiting. Oh, he's killed me. Oh. There we go. That's right, he shot me beforehand a few more times. Okay, um, so there we have perfect talking between the Tajin, sorry, the Mako TE with the LMOD system. Thank you.